Inside these two non-refrigerated U-Haul trucks are bodies upon bodies. Police sources also telling PIX11 as many as 60 bodies stacked one on top of another. Neighbors have been complaining about a foul odor for weeks now, prompting today's police response. There's a bunch of dry U-Haul trucks, you know, that are put, they're putting the bodies in. Uh, I see them carrying bags and bags of bodies out all day. Like, smells like uh, yeah, like a war, like World War II. This truck's been here, again, for a couple weeks now. The trucks are outside the Andrew Cleckley Funeral Home on Utica Avenue. Area residents telling PIX11 it is a disturbing sight and report remains being piled up inside as well. City officials sent in workers in full protective suits to begin the process of removing the bodies. Brooklyn Borough President Eric Adams says it's demeaning to both the deceased and their loved ones. When you find bodies in trucks like this, throughout our city, treating them in an undignified manner, that's not acceptable. Many of the city's funeral homes have been filled to capacity, many of them victims of COVID-19. Funeral directors and their staff have been working around the clock trying to cope with the rising number of deaths during this pandemic. Adam says we can't put the blame solely on funeral homes. More needs to be done. It starts at the cemetery. If we don't start increasing the bodies we put in the ground, then they're going to stay above ground. We need to have the medical examiner not do 8 to 8. He needs to be to 12 o'clock so funeral directors can actually get there. By late this evening, a tarp was placed outside, covering the trucks to continue the removal into refrigerated trucks. PIX11 has made repeated attempts to reach out to the Cluckley Funeral Home. We have not gotten a response yet. Now, the State Department of Health is also investigating. BP Adams tells us that he's putting together a bereavement uh, committee to come up with a plan to deal with the handling of so many bodies citywide. We're live in the Flatland section of Brooklyn tonight. I'm Shirley Chan, PIX11 News.